The Logitech G Pro Wired has been one of my favorite gaming mice for the past couple of years, especially since the first time that I used it, but I always thought that it was just a little ancient. Well, this mouse right here, the orange one that you guys are seeing on screen right now, is the Game Visions Orbit. This mouse is such a great product and a spiritual successor to the Logitech G Pro Wired as well as the Logitech G305. But the Game Vision's Orbit improves on the Logitech G Pro formula so much, it just modernizes the mouse and makes it the mouse that we wish that Logitech made for us years ago. This one weighs in at less than 60 grams. It features KLGM 8.0 switches. The side buttons are very similar to the G305 and G Pro as well. And it also doesn't take a double uh, A AA or triple A battery because it's just rechargeable with USB type C, which makes perfect sense because this mouse came out in 2022. And these are the kind of basic features that we are looking for. Obviously the mouse does have holes in it, so it is a lot lighter and a lot more balanced than the G305 and G Pro Wired. If you pull off the bottom shell of the mouse, you do have a place to put your USB dongle, and you also can pull off the mouse one and two shell as well and replace it with some of the different colors that Game Visions has available. They have a white version, a blue version, as well as an orange version, which is the one that I have today. And the build quality is really good on the mouse as well. To be honest, I don't have any complaints I don't hear any creaking or cracking of the shell and you can bang it on the table a little bit which I don't recommend but I know you gamers you get mad so it's got to be a little durable and I'm happy to say that it is now in terms of uh, other things that this mouse offers it does also have PTFE feet that glide extremely well USB type C for charging and you also do have a very good and solid wireless connection to use this mouse they do maintain the DPI button at the top just like the G Pro wired and G305 so in the, inside the software you can just map one DPS setting and set that to a function in game the scroll wheel is incredibly smooth as well and does feature an LED light um, other than the fact that you can change the aesthetics of this mouse pretty easily and the feel in the hand is very good and similar to the G305 even though it might be just slightly bigger than the Logitech G Pro and G305 this thing is absolutely great it's going on sale pretty soon for 80 bucks which I think is an extremely fair price for now and hopefully as time goes on, that price drops to maybe about like 70 or 60 bucks. That would be fantastic. But I really don't have anything bad to say about the Game Visions Orbit. This thing is great. This is the mouse, again, that we wish Logitech would have made absolutely years ago. And they just never did. So I'm glad that Game Vision stepped up to the plate. They came out with the mouse that we've always wanted. And even though I love the G Pro Super Light, it has been my main for a while. Ever since I got this thing, I just cannot put it down. This might be my new main. I'm not gonna say so just yet, but I've been using it a lot recently and I haven't really been in the mood to switch mice. It's just so comfortable. And it's almost like a nostalgia from like two years ago from when I first tried the G Pro Wired. So this thing is really good. Highly recommend it and highly recommend that you check it out if you're using a Logitech G305 right now and you're tired of buying batteries for your uh, 90 gram mouse. That is, you know, I'm surprised that Logitech even refreshed last year by adding new colors, but uh, yeah. The color options too, orange and blue, like come on guys, you knew I was gonna get this mouse. Regardless if they sent it to me or not, I was gonna buy it, because this thing is uh, it's made for me. It's made for me. It's made for you guys too. Check it out, link in the description. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoy, drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.